here we are. My assassin level 78 hollow woman. A lot of strength, a lot of dexterity. I'm aiming to equip a runic talon so I can upgrade my weapon from a greater talons to a runic talons. The rest in vitality just below 1000 life. Resists are average. When I proc level 15 fade, they will be a bit better. Right now I'm on 14% damage reduced, which is mostly the helm and the fate that is currently level 4. I have a lot of magic damage and damage reduced flat. These two. Replenish life from the bulwark. No better chance. No MF. A little gold from monsters. Knockback. Which is pretty important for my build. And the rest are not that very interesting important stats maybe poison land reduced 121 and cannot be frozen so the gear this really good greater talents bulwark helm crafted gloves that rolled with a knockback which is not guaranteed in bt diablo treachery crafted belt with poison land reduced damage and magic damage I can have a better belt in fact good boots dual res faster and walk damage and magic damage reduced prime shield and again damage magic damage reduced a little vitality a little mana enhanced defense fire resist and this is what I crafted Last night, one assassin, faster cast rate, mana, and 13 all res. My mercenary has just got his treachery. He rocks bulwark, life, minimum damage, frost nova on stroke and faster hit recovery, dual leech, basically life leech, and dual res and very poor partisan and i'm looking for an ethereal elite base creates craft something for him here belt 76 what was the craft or safety belt Tau. I still have a lot of Tau runes. One. Ooh, I need to add an Ed room. I almost crafted myself a non material belt that would have been unpleasant and I have to downgrade tall room because I have no pet rooms okay like this And I need Charles's mass. I did not show the skills, so I'm fully blade. I have fully respect into blade sin. And the rest of the points are in Shadow Master, no points in Martial Arts. And here we have Faster Hit Recovery, Poison Land Reduction, 
Okay, I don't need the cold resist. I have a lot of cold resist. I don't think that my mercenary needs it as well. So let's go find Diablo. These dual auras are just what I need to end my run. Can I push this ghost over the terrain? The assassin is just insane with her crowd control. As you can see, I have a pretty high damage for hill difficulty and that's the main reason why I'm still alive and still moving forward with this playthrough. Basically the changes in BT Diablo have made the assassin a real beast. The updated weapons. I was just checking before I started that the runic balance damage is more than doubled. I need to get points from Tyrael. Perfect amethyst. Not bad at all. Resists are pretty bad. With lower resist.
shadow has given up. Let's see this. Let's see this Balkata. Just in case, if you're new to the stream and BT Diablo, the lead density in Nightmare and in Hell difficulty is increased. I think it was 10% more on Nightmare and another 5% more leads on Nightmare and 10% more on Hell difficulty, which in BT Diablo it's called insanity and the nightmare difficulty is called agony respectively Make sure I don't put Grand Vizier out. And I'll have to beat him with the Venom. Okay. So far, so good. I've seen the combat shrine, I think I'll keep it for Diablo. Yay, another holiday gift. I think this is my fifth gift. I've had a lot of gifts. Let's see what runes will be there for me this time. Holiday gift. Okay, soul runes, iron runes. Not bad. Material tool to open sockets. Do I want to sacrifice the damage and magic damage reduced for some resists? My strategy to survive is basically to clear as much, as many mobs as possible. And as I've already mentioned, I have a pretty decent damage output. Let's 
see if Lord Disease will fall on my face this time. And done. Insane crowd control. Real battle tests. Let's see. Nothing. I can imbue it. Oh! I keep on forgetting the order, and I'll have to clear all of them. Okay. The vector is down. Can I? Get over here to kill all of you. Stuff. Iron spear, I'm going to sell it. Okay, let's go grab the magic find gear. Let's not sell the testers. The downside of this playthrough is that I'm stashing even more garbage in case I need it which doesn't happen most of the time the magic find gear which puts me to something like 90 but minus 90 I mean this run is quite far from magic finding without magic find on the gloves and the boots is that it I think so Okay, let's try to survive without the resists. And done. Mistake is finally corrected. 
Oh, no materials. And let's remember to get the points from material. Thank you, tutorial. Okay, act five. Let's go. I don't think I need this life. Can I beat the game in the hell difficulty for one hour? This is the ring, this is the ring. I need some more gold. Ooh. Very slow attack speed. And the damage is pretty decent. Like this, let's see it. <clears throat> Waters. Ah, we'll save it next. Not that the slingers, the spear cats, are better. I don't know what's good Act 5 monster composition, but I know archers are not that. <clears throat> and it will take a bit rock. Better fate. Okay. This is already better composition. Let's see. Oh, okay, cool rats is better. Let's try. Moving without paying too much attention to the mobs around and see how far I can go. Not too far. I was thinking about putting one point into Dragon Flight so I can reposition my team.
Ooh. So many auras. He absolutely one shot my mercenary. These are champions. Okay, orange on it. Nice. again no way to finish this one in an hour Just no way thank you for the dead sentry shadow Probably the upside of having quill rats over the skeletons is that I can leech from the quill rats. And I could use Clock of Shadows as well. I don't know why I keep forgetting about that, but I do. quite focused into the game so little to no commentary this time
bit more faster cast rate would have been handy so I'm quicker in casting Mind Blast and it does the job. I found quite a lot of these ethereal champion swords. Ooh. That hurt. forward, how convenient. So far, so good. I've been thinking about streaming, but I'm rather too exhausted to start streaming now. I really want to get this done. At your service. So I under. Let's. I can actually sock it. My weapon. I don't think I need more attack rating, so I will socket it with fire resist only. Thirty fire resist low. And I think I have a lightning resist ring. I have a lightning resist ring. Let's 
see what's the deal in Reed Highland. The suicide scene has jumped into the action. Okay. Okay. But spear women are not the worst. And the slingers are pretty much. This will be another episode of me slowly pushing forward and clearing a lot of minions so I have a safe way forward. Are you the orange enchanted? No, you are not. I think that this super unique is the orange enchanted. Sharp shoot slayer. Okay. I've got him. So it wasn't him with the aura. Okay. with Might Aura is a recipe for a disaster. Okay, let's walk by the edge. So I have a flang. I will know which direction the minions will arrive from. I really hope that I can have demon imps. Ooh, chest. Okay. I wasn't paying too much attention and I thought that these are these this was my mercenary in the narrow places like these rams it is really difficult to run in what what's that to run in different directions Okay. I have some attack rating. 
another part of that that makes this run manageable and enjoyable is the amount of attack rating I have. So I can reasonably hit on that. Not only that my damage is decent. My attack rating is decent as well. I have a couple of weapons prepared for an Act 5 mercenary, but I never got to hiring one. Okay. Knowing that this is a hardcore, I'm so patient and so careful moving forward and clearing minions and everything. Let's see how things will be with the Ancients. Who was here is the orange enchanted. Okay. Balrog skin is always nice. Let's go sell some stuff. Yeah, I, I know that you are amazed. Oops, I need to keep this ring safe. I think that I will need the ring for the world stone chamber. Will this cryptic sword be ethereal as well? Oh, it's not. It's white. I, I saw it as grey. Never mind. More slingers. I don't want to fight all of you. And now I remember that I had combo right for the Diablo fight in Chaos Sanctuary. I forgot about. Ethereal. Oh, 
one of the downsides of BT Diablo is that I'm so used to seeing items level 85 that I don't pay much attention, I totally disregard them. Like it, it's nothing. That's because in BT Diablo almost all areas are 85 in insanity. Areas in insanity are level 85. What's the fast here? Only material. I have not even realized that Come on my mercenary I have not even realized that I was walking on the short end of the map. Okay. King Potions starts now. These monsters are testing the durability on my shield Okay. So lightning damage is not bad at all. Spike. War fork. Material and gauntlets. Just it. Trash socket. Hello. Trash socket. Goodbye. Superior Q hub. And let's go get rid of the curse. Because those are pretty, pretty deadly. Afternoon. Good afternoon. Hmm. 
We need a fast I don't think so. Minimum damage. It's this 200k. Okay. I've got some cash. Do I even build this one? Or do I roll another weapon on the warp bike? So I go straight to the left over here. Okay. These mobs are pretty quick. I think I'll handle them. It's been a while since I got a jewel. Well, the mercenary has 3k damage. He's a beast. Evil Un, no way. with might aura mercenary hold on there Socket Colossus Blade, although it is not material, so it will not roll. I don't think would an owner roll something interesting in this one. It's double the damage. will be around 400 and I already have a 400 so maybe I'm light plate baby why I did not pick the shrine This looks scary.
Come on, Glacial Trail. You're not here? So sad. Am I looking in the right direction? Okay, yep. I still expect it to be somewhere here. Like, over here. Thank you, game. Can I have a skip? Okay, the frozen guys are pretty slow. I hope I can survive them. Let's be greedy and grab item for sale. Speak room, please. Okay. Now it will be nice to find a waypoint somewhere around. Okay, the saber cats are better. Not like the auras that I have here. And the most worrying thing is that I don't know who gives the aura. Unique. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'll have to kill this one with Venom if I ever hit it. Okay. This was challenging. game not that if i survive i can continue but it is a bit of a safety what do you need? to be able to exit in case of an, of an emergency and another champion sword I think that Emilio has deserved craft the weapon that he has. So, again,
hit and hit and an old room for blood crafting because I have a lot of rubies nowadays and a jewel and decorate what's the jewel with me okay I will craft this one so jewel Don't need this one anymore I don't think I need this so I have a jewel <coughs> let's try this war pike and I need Charles's malice again Okay, way better. Hundred to almost eight hundred damage. Four K damage. Emilio should be doing pretty well going forward. I hope. Clip this craft. Okay, here is the orange jumped. Uh, come on. Oh, will the auras ever end? Let's get back to the corner. I expected these open areas to be tricky. Also, the Emilio Holy Freeze is coming pretty clutch. Yay! Another level. I'm getting closer to the 105. Rent. Hello. That seems irrelevant nowadays. Upgrading the weapon to a runic talon. 
I don't think I need it. <clears throat> but I'm keen on doing another assassin run in the future where I play only martial arts because the assassin weapons are really really nice nowadays Socket, no material, it doesn't count. I'll go find the waypoint as an insurance. Okay. <clears throat> this was pretty nice waypoint. I haven't I don't need that one no these most of my charms are pretty trash get ready for the usual covering the ground with potions or the ancients fight Experience Shrine. Okay, okay, okay.
Тереолограмо. Спасем. I'm like a specialist in rolling pretty good ones in BT Diablo. Both in season one and in season two I have ethereal ogre moles with several hundred damage. And here we are. Good. Five minute break. And we'll start. Good morning. Morning. Act five mercenaries can be wield the ogre moles. The moles in general, generally. I guess this will be a regular in view. Okay, as I said, five minute break and I'll be back. Okay, so where were we? One thing about the ancients is that I can't teleport and I can't is it worth it to separate them over here to do the <coughs> trick where I open portal? Haven't tried it. How how hard could it be? Well, let's oceans behind the cover. <coughs> I 
drinking these potions should be enough. If I survive, I survive. If I don't... Let's use the pulse. Of course, I'll fill the cube as well. What could go wrong? Okay. Nope. Okay. Uh, actually, no. Nope. I don't think I can handle. First, by damage. Actually, we are all ethereal now. Right? The, the three of us are only ethereal. Not bad. Yeah. Might and fanaticism. <coughs> okay, I guess I spend more time to go to the town that I would it would have taken to just get rid of the curse with fate. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on over here. Down is a big deal. Okay, and none of you is immune to physical. Thank you, game. <laughs> Emilio is taking color behind the pillar as well. Pillar? A column? Oh my god, <clears throat> I've beaten Hell Ancients on Hardcore, first try, like the first hero getting. Solid. <clears throat> and not for the first time, I have used so little potions uh, we'll put those back What's a good monster composition in the world stone chamber? Let's 
grab only the fools and I'll leave the two thirds. <clears throat> okay. Okay, I'll grab these. I thought they were move potions. Okay, let's dive. <clears throat> Ooh, I'm level 80. <clears throat> okay, <clears throat> the monster composition is decent. It's the aura that makes the deal. guys are pretty serious they are one shotting both the shadow and the mercenary Let's go grab the mercenary. He is helping a lot. Okay, I'm most level eighty one. That's a big deal.
Support. Three weapon block one. Phoenix strike. Yeah. <clears throat> Okay. And level two. Okay. Now I see myself finish this in this sitting. What are these monsters that keep on coming? Let's try the other angle. Okay, let's try the town portal that I opened. I said let's buy some scrolls. And it has to the it has to be to the right of the waypoint. Only if I had bought some antidotes. Here and let's try going around the entrance. I don't remember if this costs something. Let's try. I guess the exit will be over here on the map. Why wouldn't I? 
Let's see if I, if I have the runes. I know I have a full rune. But what's... Cool. That's foul. Um. The unique is lumpal. I think I need foul and um. I don't have a foul. Oh, um, what's the durability? Okay. Okay, let's downgrade the room. Why I keep this when it's non material? I want to. Add your let's try the boots. Okay. And fall. So fall um and perfect sapphire. Okay. Fall um. I don't remember what was the damage. It was 250 something, I think. Let's see the damage sheet. Okay. I think I got at least a few hundred damage. With the upgrade. And I have more durability. Yay! <clears throat> Let's <clears throat> try imbuing these boots and get back to business. Faster on walk, call to resist. Not terrible, not great. 50k in the bank. a bit late already Sorry. He can't leech for a medium.
Okay, there is no way in that direction. Okay, I will need Emilio for the crowd control. Okay, relying on the Venom and Holy Freeze will take some time. Let's hope I don't have to go backwards. Okay, I don't have to. Yes. I used to have something over here. Okay. Course. I've had so much luck so far. Whoa, whoa, whoa.
Thank you for the dead sentry. Shadow. Here. Which one of you is the unique? Okay. Okay, so Bail will resurrect the undeads. it is nice that they come outside oh I haven't put my like this point I uh, Or cloak of shadows. <clears throat> Don't you dare. souls Take us a, a step back, please. Thank you.
Come over here, gang. Let's grab only the elite. The boss. Like this. Come on, gang. You know the deal. Insane. This run is absolutely insane. Things will get a lot dicey now. Okay. Okay. This one was pretty close, I think. <clears throat> I almost thought I had this in the bag. In the bag. And the game tries to tell me show me that it is totally not the case so let's go back to slow and steady Okay, the knockback will be the deciding factor. And let's take a breath. So the curse expires and... Let's do this. Elegant Blade, Balrog Blade. I don't see myself doing this in the three minutes before <clears throat> 19 hours. <clears throat> Do I?
has to be the real one, right? I have a crushing blow weapon as well. <clears throat> Although that one has less resists. You look like the shadow. Never mind, I'll pick you. Ooh! You were the real one. Okay. That's what I call a bad drop, but nobody cares. Greetings, greetings. I am impressed. Me too, me too. Let's go and imbue the couple of material items that I have and recap this run. <clears throat> I have intentionally stopped the clock. <clears throat> can I use the... Can I call this the first material items only run? <clears throat> At least in BT Diablo. Correct me if I'm wrong. Show me the footage. I'll keep this one. <coughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm about to, to get sick. Just before the Christmas holidays, of course. Material Ogre Hammer 
Superior Trash Superior Silver Edged Axe Okay Could have been way better <clears throat> Is there any other item I want to showcase? Not really. <clears throat> <clears throat> and let's do the recap in the World Stone Chamber. Solid. Like usual. And it is five minutes before midnight. I'll I'll get okay sleep as well. So how difficulty So hell difficulty Ethereal items only, Assassin, Hardcore, Hollow Woman, level 81. Thank you, thank you for your applause. Not necessary, but I like it. So, it's been just above 19 hours, but it was worth it. That's my first Hardcore playthrough in BT Diablo. Actually, in Diablo, ever. And this is how I did it. I decided to use the Assassin with only ethereal items with the exception of jewelry and the charms, of course. Feel free to do it without those. I don't mind. A lot of strength, a lot of dexterity. The strength is for the runic talents. The dexterity is so I have some chance of block. Not terrible, not great. The attack rating is average or bail it's okay, 50% and 64 and <clears throat> just below 1000 life, it's doable. Runic Talons, this one I think I'll check, I'll see, you'll see in the clip, in the, in the summary version, I think this one dropped from normal bail <coughs> or from nightmare bail <coughs> normal bail if if it was bail it's normal bail and it was blade talons and i upgraded it to greater talons used it for the majority of the game as greater talons it i think it had something like 100 and something 250 I'll add that to the final clip. And just before the end on this stream, on this video, I upgraded it to a runic talons. And that added like 50 more maximum damage and something less 20, 30 more minimum damage. Bulwark, mainly for the damage reduction percentage, but the other mods are also pretty decent. <clears throat> insane gloves these were my first safety gloves that I rolled I've said it over and over in BT Diablo knockback is not guaranteed on safety gloves so rolling knockback as a blade scene on an ethereal items only playthrough insane I crafted this on this stream just safety belt, nothing too interesting. Treachery, mainly for the 15 points in Fate. The Venom was also good. I was able to kill some immune to physical monsters. Pretty good amulet. Fire resist, safety ring for 
the damage and flood damage and magic damage reduction pretty nice boots you've seen this i <clears throat> i really enjoyed when i rolled them and a rhyme shield for the cannot be frozen mostly on swap i have two all skill levels these are caster claws that i used mainly for to summon my shadow master skills 1 point wonders 20 points into shadow master and the last point in clock of shadows and i was blades in for the majority of this run the hell difficulty <clears throat> was really interesting it was challenging i was able to beat it mostly because I spent the time very cautiously and very patiently to clear monsters from my way so I can move forward. I had pretty decent damage. This is without the Venom Proct. So 2000 damage on the Blade Fury. It is really nice with the combination of the knockback and Mind Blast, Clock of Shadows, insane crowd control. That's that's what saved me. The most notable drops on this run were the Holiday Gifts. Basically, they allowed me to upgrade my mercenary. Let me show you him as well. Treachery, just so I don't swap mine. I had a lot of mid runes. I had um for upping Dernic Talons, Lem for the treachery, and for this treachery is from my nightmare Hellforge. Life Bulwark Crafted Blood War Pike Ethereal Dual Leech. This is actually a pretty good ring. I think I got it from Ormus. Faster hit recovery 37. It rolled pretty nice, unfortunately. I lost the durability, so I put it on the mercenary. That's the reason I don't use it. And he needed it more. And more damage. So Emilio does very well as well. Almost 5k damage with Holy Freeze for additional crowd control. His advanced sheet, 15 Lifestone per hit, damage reduction 25, again the Bulwark and the Fate, replenished life, increased attack speed, which reminds me to show my advanced sheet, a lot of damage and magic damage reduction flat, again this is what kept me alive for the majority of this run, little to no magic find, knockback, and the rest of the stats are not something I planned and I looked for. They are what they are. The resists are pretty nice with the 30 fire res that I put in the weapon. What else? Act 5 was a challenge. I enjoyed it. I had some close calls in the world stone keep. I'm glad I made it. The ancients were was easier than I expected. Just as usual, I covered the summit with rejuvenation potions and then I got them back. I expected more from the ancients to be deadlier. I saw Talik dying first and I knew this was in the bag. I almost died on wave 5, just before I got to the throne room, to the world stone chamber. Because I thought I had this in the bag and almost lost it because they had concentration aura with cursed. And I'm glad that they did not one shot me. And that's the run. That's all. I've beaten the game on hardcore difficulty. Let's not repeat myself. Thank you so much for watching. 
this final video of the series of the ethereal items only of the ghost of the hollow woman and let me know in the comments what else would you like to see give me a challenge playthrough thanks so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye